Oh, we, have, we have the option to get some jugglers as well, so let's do that. Let's just check where are the jugglers. Yeah. Because, you know, it might go better with jugglers as well. Faster. Yeah, I'm not sure why it's optional, but uh, yeah. let's make sure we don't go to. Uh, I think. I think if we head left. Slow now. Might be better. Hard times we get in. Looking for. Need to get across the river, you see. But that path takes us way too close to the actual objective. And we don't want to go there. We want to go to get some jugglers. So. As you can see, we, we're going past it now. But the GPS is like... Like, oh, you want to go to the objective? It's like, no. You want to get them Shall jugglers. Oh. Mark this. When I got pressed into the infantry in 1242, I promised my beloved letter I'd return alive, whole, and with a pearl from Skellige. Not just any pearl either. A black one. The rarest and most precious. Well, well. Ambitious. Perhaps. But they were empty words. I came from the war. That one, and the next. But I never fulfilled my promise. I time to change that. For if not now, then when? Thing is, I've grown old in the meantime, as you see. Can't manage it alone, need a strong shoulder to lean on. And the witcher's shoulders as strong as they come. So, what do you say? Hmm. The plan's crazier than it is sane, but there's an irresistible charm to it. Offer me some pay and I'll help you out. Don't you fret about coin. I brought home a good deal of it from various fronts. Say we meet in Skellige, by the collapsed bridge near Arenbjorn. It's but a hop away from the bed where black pearls are born. Will that work for you? Sounds fine. See you there. Why not at your waist, like Bet everyone you. else? Alright, so we've got, got another quest there to get some brews. Black brew. Making sure I'm going the right way. I need to take a left. If you take a left down there, maybe. Yeah, maybe that would. It's looking really, really cozy at this time of night. Cut through here, maybe. Maybe we can, maybe we can. Faster. Can't. Ah, what the frick. For some reason my horse was running on the spot. Ah, oh. well, well, another <coughs> freak. Huh. I look like Horson's men there. All right, we're almost there. Let's Whoa, get those jugglers. Wait. 
the great git. <laughs> oh, right. Grab him. Oh, great. Keep a setup. Let's see. Let get going on. Level four teams. I see you get in the way, Roach. Ow. Come on. Got me stunned. I suppose Roach was just trying to help, but uh, when the horse is kicking, it's hard to, hard to get focused. Hey, some blue swords. These guys are really kitted out. All got blue swords. But which is the least valuable? Let me throw some of these away. Maybe they fell in long sword. Yeah, so I need to sell some stuff. Sell me some blues. Right, where are my jugglers? Puffins present concert and delights, private performances, amusements for children. Yeah, here they are. Ladies. Nice tune. Damn sad, though. Then it successfully conveys my mood. What do you seek here? Looking for the puffins. Have I found them? We've no coin. Leave us be! Think there's been a mistake. Sorry. Thought our landlord had hired another thug to collect from us. Don't want any coin from you. In fact, I'm willing to pay you, provided you agree to get the word out about Madame Arena's new play. Oh, afraid that's impossible. Ever since we premiered our fateful ballad about Holy Hemelfart, who his faith ignores, gorges himself, diddles old whores, Fatso's gang has been harassing us incessantly. Fatso's gang? Common thugs and the church's pay. City's full of gangs like that now. They threaten me, sir. Said they round off her pointy ears with a carving knife. They don't let us perform. Chase away spectators, destroy our instruments. Lately they've taken to lurking outside our home. We're at wit's end, no clue what to do. Hmm. They harm any of you? No, not yet. But it's merely a question of time. Nisa overheard talking about setting fire to something. All right. Say I get Fatso and his boys to leave you alone. Will you publicize Arena's play then? Of course. But you shan't find it easy. There's no talking to that lot. I'm not a great talker anyway. <laughs> I'm still overburdened. <laughs> yeah, let's get rid of that. And that. Don't need it. We'll get that. 50 stamina. Tamir and saddlebags. I think that's better than what I dropped. Enhanced racing saddle, and we've got superior, yeah. Alright, where's these thugs? I wonder if they're as badass as the others. How dare you to say it again! I, I didn't say nothing! Not enough, he's a heretic, he's also a liar! So you're the ones. Oi, right, Fatso, look what we got here! Is it just me, or you got cat eyes? Right, he does! Stray cat must have fucked his mum! <laughs> now, what you doing in the city of eternal fire, cat shit? 
Leave the puffins alone. Worms that insulted the Iraq Emil fart? Called him an allmonger? I'd sooner snuff out the holy flame itself. Tell them fucking poets to come down here. Shove their fruits up their blaspheming assholes. Yeah, to play a different tune then, every time they fought. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wish I had delusion level T. I must remember to invest in that. Get out of here. Now. What? Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Keep Level together, 11. Legs. We can't kill him. Who oh. killed him? Oh. All right, enough. Damn it, enough. Orange leg. Ah, oh, what a sight. You really showed him. One, two over the back, then pow, right in the noggin. I'll finally be able to leave my home without hiding beneath a hood. Thank you very much. Come on, it was nothing. Oh, it was something, all right. I don't dare think we've forgotten our promise. We'll strip our voices ragged praising Arena's new play. How much will I owe you? Not a copper. Helped us out. See no reason why we shouldn't help you. Get half of town to come to the play. Wait and see. Some quick preparations and we'll be out in the streets. <laughs> Till the next. Mmm, that was easy. What I had. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we leveled up. Let's see, we, let's see if we can get delusion. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Hmm. Delusion. What's that in there? Yeah, I wonder what that's under. And if I look control, focus, study sharp, cat school techniques. I don't know. And under signs, it looked like it was a sign. Let me have a look. Yeah, I do believe it's to it's linked with the uh, with the axi. Because it charms people's minds. So we'll go for that. The higher the better. Sword. Alright, so now we need to tell Arena the good news. I'm doing so I had. So many drunks. Faster. I'm looking forward to seeing the play. I hope it's good. It's not, I hope it's not too dramatic. So, how do you go with this thing? I was going to pick up my nose. Here, Doppler, shit. Yeah, yeah, here we are. Door on the left. Door on the left, alright. We can just go straight in, huh? Boars. Boars everywhere. The truth is, we're all ready to pen. Ah, there, she there is. you are. Managed to hire some ushers. Wonderful. That's one matter resolved. The text need to discuss that. Yes. Wanted to talk about the text itself. Hmm. It's not at all badly written. In fact, I quite like it. I was willing to relax my standards to help Dudu, but we may have something very interesting here. I have very clear ideas who to cast as the servant, the witcher, and the queen, but I'm not certain who should play the prince and the princess. Hmm. Who is playing the witcher? An amateur. It'll be my first time working with him, but I'm confident he'll pull it off. 
Newcomer to the troop? In a sense. Oh, stop pretending you don't know. <laughs> I'm talking about you. Oh, no. <laughs> hmm. It's a good idea. Doubt I'll get a standing ovation, but Dudu will see me. That's the key. But you will make an effort, won't you? Learn your lines at least. Sure. I'll give it a shot, of course. So who do you see playing the Doppler Prince? I'm finding it hard to decide between two candidates. Abelard Ritzer would be the safer bet. He's been part of our troop for ages, has flawless technique, but he doesn't exactly captivate the crowds. Who's your other option? Maxim Bolia, outstanding actor, and audiences love him. But sadly, I can never be sure he'll show up sober, or that he'll show up at all. Hmm. Let's risk it and give the role to Maxim. He's had a good spell of late, so maybe he won't let us down. So, about the princess. Small part, but an important one. Any idea who could play her? Priscilla would be the obvious choice. She's young and beautiful. Yet, I do have more stage experience. Hmm. Role's yours. Talent and experience Trump looks in my book. I'm honored. I shall give it my all. I'm <laughs> getting rich off this. All right. Got the cast figured out. It seems so. Prepared to plunge headlong into your career as a mama? Mama, we can start now. We <laughs> can start now. Looked over the script out of curiosity. We can start any time, even now. Well, we've no time to lose. Come to the stage. Zoltan, what are you doing here? <laughs> Pissy told me you ought to put on a play. <laughs> are you playing the lead? I'm not the lead. Oh, I thought to myself, I'd sooner shave my beard than miss that. Tell me what you are. Are you going to wear hose and a codpiece? <laughs> Come, Geralt. You must focus your mind before you go on stage. Good luck. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this should be good. Most honorable citizens of the hallowed city of Novigrad, welcome. We have for you a tale moving and heartbreaking. Its title The Doppler's Salvation. The players, Witcher Geralt as himself. Katerina as the queen, Leo Ribe as the humble servant, appearing as the prince, the delight of audiences far and wide, Maxime Bollier. And as the princess, renowned artiste, beloved queen of the stage, Irina Reynard. Act one, here we go. Majesty, the monster slayer awaits. Your summons he's answered and stands at the gates. Show him in. I must speak to the man. Lest that dread beast take my daughter's hand. Witcher, your task is a matter most tender. Her monster shall show a tonight's beastly splendor. Stand guard, beware, kill the beast if he shows. And a grateful queen shall reward your woes. To slay beasts most foul. Was for this I was made. I kill as my calling, not just to get paid. <laughs> He's swallowed the bait, this fool of a witcher. I'll ensure the foul bow reveals his true figure. The monster revealed, the witcher shall strike. The beast will he slay, thrust his head on a pike. Oh! 
My child will pity her love, this beast, but a fiend and a maid. No, this must cease. Fair enough. <laughs> Gathered are we, a host fair and noble, to celebrate this day, the princess's betrothal. Alas, no monster do I see or hear. Perhaps midst the guests he hides, in fear. <laughs> My dear, long have we hid our love's tender oh, no. fires. In stealth we'd kiss, um, uh, <laughs> deceitful like liars. Tonight shall it end. Be my wife. That's my plea. Our hearts torment over. We shall love for centuries. Oh, darling, I will, I will, I will. Wait, with wine must we toast this moment joyful. If not, a foul curse shall rend your lives woeful. Ah, it is not wine, but a brew spiked with silver. Soon all shall see my true monstrous figure. <laughs> hark, hark, tis no prince, but a Doppler imposter. If the maid loves him, it seems we've lost her. Behold, Witcher, the beast of which I spoke. Unleash your sword. Let fly the killing stroke. Stop. Stop. Beast or man, tis my love, my betrothed. Sheath your blades, fear a Doppler. Tis a thing most foolish. Changing one's shape does not make one ghoulish. Remember, tis not flesh a monster makes. But a lack of morals. And a surfeit of cakes. <coughs> Witcher, tis true. This wretch's foul suspicions tainted my mind with this plan so malicious. The Doppler must live. My daughter he'll wed. Beast or man, she loves him truly without dread. Tis our tale's end, good folk. And its moral is this. No monster is he whose shape can shift. The Witcher is just a true Doppler's friend. But you, foul page, in chains you shall end. God, call the God, remove the traitor at once. Hey, hear the princess's command. Come up here. Come on then, governor. Up you go. On stage. Toss the traitor scum in the dungeon. Don't be afraid. In the end, everyone will live happily ever after. Doppler and Princess wed the same night. The servant's heart melted. He wept at the sight. Doppler's to the stake! Burn them all! Kill. He's right. I mummers don't know the eternal fire's commandments. Blasphemers! Order teach them respect for the faith! What are you on about? Shut the fuck up and clap before I tear you new arseholes. Tear me a new one? We'll see about that. On your feet, boys! Give him a taste of hell in the name of the church! Give us a hand, Witcher. Can't take him on our own. Oh, great. Knew it would end with fighting. Rumble time! <laughs> Stop walking into his wall! <laughs> 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 
Oh, but we're using that though. Rumble time! Rumble time! Pass them. Decapitation. Fun's over. Back to places. Come on. Looking for someone else, wife. Oh, a chicken sandwich. Oh. Someone brought us a nice, uh, nice uh, KFC. Okay, let me talk to Doo Doo. How do we know that was Doo Doo though? I mean, yeah, it looked a bit shifty, but it could have been anyone. It was kind of strangely done, really. I'm gonna collect these because food is good. But yeah, that, that was kind of strange how we picked them out from the crowd just like that. Get out, I wanted to hear what he thought of the performance. A storm, damn it. Ah, there Geralt, it is. Geralt, you recognized me. How'd you do it? Greetings, Dudu. Heard about that souvenir Horson left on your face. Ah, that's her. So, you know everything? Have you seen Siri? No. Still looking for her. Geralt! Masterful! You did great. Haven't they laughed that hard in ages? <laughs> Lads won't believe it when I tell them. Explain one thing to me. How do you and Dandelion manage to displease Reuven, Horson, and the Temple Guard all at the same time? It's not as if we planned it. <laughs> Why didn't you find Priscilla or the Mummers? Contact them. I came to a few performances, different shape each time, but I dared not show myself. Feared I'd put them at risk. Then I got word of a new mumming. Saw it as my chance to learn something, anything, about Siri and Dandelion. I know Siri went back to Horsens to get you. How'd you manage to escape? I ran after her, wanting to keep up, but I'd have been a hindrance. She called out to me, entreated me to shapeshift and disappear. I tried to find them, Siri and Dandelion. It was as if they turned to vapor. Fearing for my life, I shifted each day, becoming someone else. Even considered turning into Siri to trick her pursuers, but. Slow down, Marmalade. Hmm. Geralt, when did you last see Cirilla? Hmm? Been a while, hasn't it? A while, yeah. For me, likewise. Must be a full grown lass by now. Do, do, do us a wee favor. Show us Siri for a moment. Geralt? Transform. Change into her. I feel strange. Both of you staring at me bug-eyed. Is that enough? Yeah. Plenty. Bad idea. Not angry with me, are you, Geralt? No. I feel relieved. And Dandelion? Were you able to find him? Witch hunters nabbed him. But there's good news, too. We think we can free Dandelion. Just need your help. What could I do? Take on Menga's appearance. Then go and give the order for Dandelion to be moved to Oxenfurt. We'll lie in ambush in a ravine en route. Spring Dandelion from the convoy when it rolls by. Wait, not so fast. How am I to be Menga? And I've no notion where Dandelion's being held. Hmm. Dandelion's on Temple Isle, imprisoned there. You'll need to find out exactly where. But what if they grow suspicious? 
Start asking questions. I'll bet my best axe no one will pester the commander of the Temple Guard. Besides, you're a Doppler and an actor, and an actor and a Doppler. Got double the spark to improvise your way out of any situation. If things get spicy, you'll just nip round the corner and transform into a buxom wench, a, a jackdaw, or whatever else strikes your fancy. Of course, it's that simple. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> no one knows Menga's dead. No need to worry about being exposed. No one save you. Would this have anything to do with the fire at the witch hunter's barracks? We were in the area. <laughs> I sorely regret not seeing that. Listen, you'll manage. Everybody believes Manga's missing. You can make up any story you want. My lads and me will lie in ambush in the ravine. Geralt will then join us and we'll await word from you. But how am I to contact you as Menga? Send word that the convoy's left. You'll need to figure that out. Come on, Guile's your middle name. So, we all clear? Dudu, get your ass to Temple Isle. I'm off to assemble my crew. And we'll be waiting for you, Geralt. Yeah, see you in the ravine. Whoa, wait! Hold on! What happens after? I, I hope you don't expect me to continue as Menga, live like Chappelle, burning the occasional heretic to keep up appearances? No, once it's over, we expect to see you at the Rosemary in time, where we'll all meet. To get pissed like wild badgers. So, <laughs> settled? Let's get to work. Not bad. Not bad at all for your first time out. Just a few minor trip-ups. The performance in general. What did you think? I doubt the audience understood it all, but that's to be expected. I'm just pleased the Puffins got the word out. That was quite the crowd. Such a shame Maxim went on stage inebriated after all. Some of the crowd demanded refunds. Oh. Here you are. Your fee. I must admit your style of mumming, well, it's quite... Minimalist. Did you study anywhere? At Kaer Morhen. Minimum expression means maximum effect. Thanks for the coin. Take care now. So I would have got more money if uh, if we'd done the performance better. Hopefully Priscilla's not pissed off with us. Hmm. Geralt! No. Oh. Take care now. Oh, come on. She should have said something. Honestly. You think they could add like a couple of lines of dialogue like, Oh, I thought you would have cast me for the part. No. Or something. I suppose that would be unnecessary, but still would have been a nice touch. Oh, quest upstated the place. Uh-huh. Hmm. Poet under pressure. Yeah. Wow, so much stuff around here. I was not expecting that. So, next up we'll be doing a lovely ambush, and hopefully nothing happens to Doodoo. -doo. I'm sure something will go wrong, but uh, we'll have to wait and see what exactly goes wrong. I think that's everything. Yeah, no doubt either either uh, Doodoo's going to get discovered, or like he'll get discovered and they'll go down the route anyway, but they'll know they're going to get attacked or something. So it'll be like a trap. Uh, or... I don't know. Something will go wrong. But we'll, we'll deal with it when it comes. Anyway, till next time, guys.